Hey guys, welcome to another video by DJS PRC. I want to take a couple seconds here uh, to show the difference between the Loctites. Basically what I have on my bench here right now, it's Bob Smith and the TLR. I am missing one of them, these guys, there's a green too. Because you have a uh, red, blue, and a green. Now the difference between red, green, and blue is green is very light. Uh, it holds your screw in, but you don't need a lot of force to break that screw basically to be able to unscrew it. Now, if we start just by the red one right here, it's basically, this is thread lock, high strength. When you use red on your bolts, let's say like this dry shaft here, on your set screw, you would use a red one. Um, I'll try to show you guys here, it might be a little bit hard. You don't want to use red. Basically, when using red is you apply red to the thread, screw it in, and forget about it. And really forget about it, you won't be able to remove it. The only way you'll be able to remove it half the time is by drilling it out or using a blowtorch to heat it so much to liquefy that thread lock again. That's why I rarely, rarely, rarely use red. The one I would use most on this set screw here would be the blue ones. I have the TLR here, Treadlock, or the Bob Smith, they're both great. Um, one's a little bit more compact. When I'm going on the road, I'll bring this one with me. And basically, you just unscrew it, put a little bit on your, on your tread, screw it in, and forget about it. Now, let's say you have a lot of vibration, that screw won't come off by itself because of the Loctite. Basically, Loctite is a little bit like you're gluing something. Uh, the glue will keep it there. There's one thing you have to be very careful with Loctite. You cannot use it, let's say, this would be a plastic piece, and your screw is plastic, uh, but plastic steel, but Loctite in on plastic, not good. The Loctite will melt the plastic, and bad things will happen. Now, let's say this was plastic, you want to glue in the screw because it comes out by itself. What I would suggest is basically you could use CA. This is the glue you use to glue your tires. Now, when you are going to do use CA for your screw, that's physical screw, you're going to put a little bit on the tread itself and square the back end. If you put too much, it will go where it needs to turn. But I'll show this in a future video. Basically, like I said, you have three kinds. You have green, blue, and red. Physical blue is the one for everyday use, let's say. It's the one that's basically when you use your screwdriver, you'll be able to take it off by hand. But vibration-wise, it won't. If you need to use it, use the blue. Do not use red. When you use red, it's basically you glue in it there. It's going to be extremely hard to remove. That's why we all always use blue, steel on steel, aluminum, aluminum, not plastic. If you guys have any questions, post them below. I'll be glad to answer you guys. If you love this video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give it a thumbs down. And don't forget to subscribe, guys. Thanks.